pretty much I'm going to tell you about a service, I think it's called Geeky, and you can stream games in your browser, so you can play uh, Battlefield Bad Company 2, hang on, let me just have a look here, you can play Battlefield Bad Company 2, FIFA 12, Crisis 2, yes you can play Crisis 2 in your browser. Now, I think these are the demo versions, otherwise I'm pretty sure it would be illegal, but apart from that, it's a very solid service if you have good internet. Now, I don't have particularly good internet, uh, so it does lag a bit, but it's playable, and you don't get the frame rate drops you do if you're actually running it on the computer, because you can play Crisis 2 on this service on an old laptop or something which is absolutely astonishing um, sorry about that I uh, just uh, dropped the mic but anyway so you can get farming simulator as well and that's I'm gonna do a video of that because that is it's ridiculous and uh, one that people will be excited for is The Witcher 2 uh, which I played around with uh, quite a fun game and things like that. I will make more videos on this, but I know I haven't been posting videos. It's because I've been trying things out. You know, I've been trying uh, different things to do. I mean, I thought about buying Modern Warfare 3 to uh, make it a COD channel, but then I realised I play Battlefield more on PC. So, what's the point? Um. But yeah, uh, the service name, the name of this company is Geeky, and I'll put a link in the description. Uh, you, I believe you still have to have an EA account to play the online portions of the games, if you even can, because I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. But yeah, it, it's a brilliant service, and it's much better than OnLive, because it's in the browser, so you can just open up a new tab if you want to go on, I don't know, Twitter or Facebook, or even YouTube, and the game will still be running. You don't have to control alt delete uh, to get to the task manager, or delete it, because it will still be running, and when you, go, when you go to a new tab, I believe the sound won't play either, which is brilliant. I mean... You know, it's like multitasking at its best. You can play a game, you can put it down, and you can come back to it at any time. Now, once you finish the game, it will ask you if you want to buy it, and it will link you to, like, Origin or somewhere, which is kind of a bugger. But I think this Geeky thing is mostly for EA games, because uh, Battlefield, Crisis, Crisis and... Uh, I'm not sure, no, The Witcher 2 is not, but, yeah, um, the actual person that told me about this, I mean, didn't tell me, but it was a video on it, was Duncan3303, and he's a tech reviewer, and I just browsed his videos and found this, and I found it really interesting, and I thought you guys should check it out, so if you want cloud gaming at its best in a browser, uh, with a few games, you should definitely try this. I'm Ikumzi, and I'm 